Yarn over. This increase is a popular way to add stitches to your project, but also leave decorative holes. You'll find yarn overs used quite a bit in lace knitting as they're placed strategically to create a pattern. To work a yarn over, you're just going to move the yarn over the needle, kind of the way you wrap a stitch, but without putting your needle through a stitch first. So we wrap from underneath, over the needle and toward the back, and then you continue to work the next stitch. So what's created is a loop that's not attached to the other stitches beside it, and that loop has the right leg in front and the left leg behind. You can already see the hole that's going to be created as we work over the top of the stitch in the next row. So we wrap over and knit, and you'll work the yarn over wherever you see it indicated in the pattern. If you are a thrower, the yarn over is going to look just like this, and then knit, and it feels just like the way you wrap when you're knitting a stitch without actually putting the needle tip into the stitch. And you can check and make sure you've wrapped correctly if when you look at the loops of the yarn over, the right leg is in the front. If you wrap like a crocheter, like that, you'll see the left leg is in front here. And you can even see that the lean is different. These stitches tend to lean to the left, and the incorrectly wrapped yarn over leans to the right. So be careful to wrap correctly where the yarn comes under the needle and over the top to the back.